Okay, we got another fun one for us tonight, you guys. I'm excited about this one. Uh, what we're gonna do to start out, you just play long. You gotta play long. It does. It could be back of an envelope. Some of you have journals that you're now keeping that just kind of have the regular, yep, I see that. Elle's got her own little journal that she does. Um, it can be anything. And uh, we're just gonna take it step by step. Uh, it's been kind of fun because I've been doing this with a live audiences now that we've been getting back speaking and stuff. And uh, we were in, uh, we got to speak in Hawaii a couple weeks ago and I had the whole whole group was, was, uh, was drawing. It was, but he couldn't do the dandelions. Sometimes he'll do weeds and wishes, but yeah. they do not have dandelions in yeah, Hawaii. It would have been Luckily weird. we knew that because um, that has been a thing in the past. Yeah. So yeah. So, okay. Fun. Let's mm -hmm. go. Uh, let us draw. What we're going to do is we're going to draw kind of like a, it's going to sound weird, but it's almost like a tombstone at the bottom of your page. That's see how I'm doing this is almost like a, a, a rectangle, but with a, with a, with a corners that are round. Mm -hmm. So it kind of looks like a gravestone, which is pretty appropriate for uh, Halloween, even though we're not drawing a gravestone. What we're going to do now is we're going to draw a, uh, an oval right here. And again, as always, don't feel that you have to draw a perfect oval or uh, oval of a certain shape or size. Your variation on your drawing is gonna make your drawing look different Excellent. and have its own little personality. Mm -hmm. All right, now we're gonna draw a couple lines. One about here, one about here. All right. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna draw a line here and a line here. And then two more lines, just like that. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now what we're going to draw is a uh, kind of a square. I guess kind of a rectangle square, a little bit like that. All right. Now what we're going to do is we're going to draw um, a line here and a line here. Are you? Mm -hmm. Did you quit? <laughs> Just like look, then you just stop. I couldn't tell where the lines were. And then a V right there. Okay. And then we're going to draw a triangle like that. And another triangle on the other side. Oops. I'm going to move that there. Okay. Now let's draw a line here and here. Okay, and then we'll draw a line right in the middle of this rectangle here. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then one, two. And if I can, uh, if I'm doing my job right, no one knows what the hell this is yet, <laughs> which is good. Okay, that's my that's always my little personal challenge to myself. All right, now we're going to draw a couple lines across this oval, and it kind of works out good if they're a little cockeyed. And I'm thinking maybe like four, maybe five, depending if you have a really oblong um, oval. Now there might be some clues coming in here. And then we're going to draw another line right across there. And another one right there. All right. And now we're going to put some eyes in. And now it's going to start. You're going to kind of tell. We got to... We got a mummy going here. Okay. Sweet. All right. Now we're going to draw a triangle like that and like that. And we're going to draw a line across and fill in the bottom like that. We got happy. It's a happy smiling mummy. <laughs> Why is he a happy smiling mummy? Because. Uh, well, first let's draw a little rectangle sticking out right here. Okay. Mm -hmm. And another rectangle sticking out the other side, but it's going to be a little higher. Just a little bit subtle. And then we're going to draw a couple more lines here with this arm. And this is, this is a happy mummy because he is a mummy in Hawaii. <laughs> And he's wearing a Hawaiian shirt. So this is where you can get kind of creative. I'm just going to put a couple different 
uh, flowers. You can do big banana leaves if you feel like you can draw those or any sort of pattern you want. But this is just shaka, one way. It's got loose, a little shaka, like. yep. Mm -hmm. And then, of course, you gotta you can then color them in. And and the best part is coloring that um, shirt, right? Mm -hmm. So let's do this. Can we... Come on. I wonder how many mummies have ever been drawn in Hawaiian shirts. Uh, this might be the first, but I doubt it. I'm sure someone, Someone's nothing new under the sun. No, that's true. Um, because there are Halloween decorations in Hawaii. I'm sure this is a thing. But... Yeah, we actually saw Halloween decorations and, uh, there was skeletons riding surfboards. Yeah. I remember they were, they were actually quite appropriate for the area, which that's I was true. curious about because they don't. I don't think Halloween when I think Hawaii, but obviously. It's kind of like if you go to a warm place, like in, especially like Florida, palm trees, that sort of thing, or at Christmas, right? Santa yep. with his. Yeah. Santa's his got his Hawaiian, Hawaiian shirt, shirt on or something. Right. Yeah. 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 So I'm going with a total pink. Oh, yeah. You were going. I'm bright. going all out here. Yes. One of my favorite parts about having this on Zoom now, guys, is the fact that you can hold them up. So no pressure, but it is fun to be able to see what you made right away. Of course, you can still email them to us so we can have them in our inbox. But Yeah, we wish you would because we can see them better than that way. Right. Okay. Um, so I'm finishing mine up. Did you, you got your colors going in here, Kim? Yeah, I think it's looking pretty good. Mm -hmm. I know Rachel's been putting up on Facebook some of the old school videos you did with uh, like how to draw monsters and stuff like that. Oh. These are like super old. They're from like, I don't know, 2008. That was like, right. Yeah, I was going to say before Lucy was yes. born maybe. And Jason did a little series of maybe four different Halloween drawings of how to draw stuff and it <laughs> just to see like the vibe is so funny because we're you're just so I'm much such younger. a young you're little... young and yeah. and uh yeah so i think she put some of those up on the league or not on the league but um in the facebook, facebook. Group. yeah adult I guess spiders unite all right kim show the right. fine people your drawing see, i like i like your yellow shirt yeah it turned out pretty good all right you guys hold yours up let me see what you, what you guys got going on from what i what I can tell, Kim, you'll have to tell me. Who's... Okay. Oh, oh yeah. We do got a paper L. plate there. Oh, paper plate. Holy cow. Owls looks great. Look at that. Uh, Brooke. I see Brooks. Uh, Rich. Martha. On the, oh, Martha's got hers on the iPad. Yes. Did you just spill? I did spill place? a little bit, but I'll go get a paper towel. <laughs> uh, Mary Beth. I see Mary Beth. That's great. Julianne. Got two there, two going on. I see. Oh, good work, guys. Good Put work. Your hand there so I don't drop Here. that. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> good job. That go. looks really like people had fun with the colors there too. I saw. <laughs> and when the people see the replay, they won't even know any of this happened at all. So, Excellent. Excellent. Uh, that's pretty good. Okay. So uh, past, let's draw, uh, Martha. Always, always incorporates mm, a little Charlie Brown action there. It. Steven, we did the uh, we did Marty last time, didn't we? Mm -hmm. Marty with the football jersey, and uh, Steven made him into a Quidditch player. Mm -hmm. And Kate Bartell, such adorable, a cute little jersey. Adorable little, oh, uh, jersey there. I love it. Um, yeah. So thank you guys. If you want to share your mummy wearing a Hawaiian shirt, please send it to KJ at escapeitallhood.com. We sure do love to see him and to share yes. him with the rest of the rest of you guys. Excellent.